Good evening. Two weeks ago, an unidentified man attacked musician Craig Albers outside SSS Top Bar here on New Street. The incident happened as Craig was headed towards a car at 10.30 at night. My friend was playing a show here. Uh, we left at about half past 10. We got into a car, well, we were going to a car which was parked across the road. Uh, when we were about halfway across the road, this guy appeared behind us and he asked us for a lift. I asked him where he wants to lift to. He said, 100 meters down the road. I told him, no, dude, you can walk. It's a bit strange for someone to ask you to lift that far. Got in the car and he was standing still next to me and he kind of held the door open, stabbed me about three times and then ran away into the darkness. I was inside, in, um, inside Slipstream. Um, there was a commotion. The people came and called me and told me what happened. Went out. We got Craig inside quickly. And then we, we got people to call the ambulance and the police. I feel the streets of Grahamstown at night are very poorly lit. Um, High Street, New Street, um, completely too dark. One of the things I think that will help very quickly is if we had to have adequate lighting in these areas. Um, I myself have put on two big spotlights on the outside of Slipstream to light up the area outside Slipstream, which has helped a little bit as well. I was leaving fires about 11.30 uh, in the evening. I was actually meeting up with a friend who was going to walk me home and then I turned into High Street. I heard running behind me and I turned around and then just two guys were on me and the one guy grabbed my arms and the other guy started using, because my bag was across my body like that, I started using it to try and like strangle me and get it off at the same time. I have really bad anxiety as it is but I, I literally couldn't sleep. Like it's so cliche but I woke up screaming quite a few times. I've definitely considered doing self-defense classes and I'm definitely buying pepper spray. If I don't have pepper spray, I'm just completely ha helpless. So I think it sort of puts me in a situation to sort of defend myself in a way, even though it might not always be effective. Students like Lindiwe often have to walk home at night, which is becoming more dangerous. Pepper spray, tasers and self-defense classes are a way of helping students defend themselves. I think the class, uh, the seminar come to be because of all these factors like violence that has been happening around Grahamstown in general. During sign up, pe most people would come saying they need to be able to, to say, de defend themselves, especially here in Grahamstown. It's more frequent and now there's, um, it's starting to become more violent and that's, that's what worries me a lot because somebody is going to get seriously hurt one day. And then, and then only then will somebody do something, I think.